The state of New Jersey is suing school districts that require national notification, parental not notification of a kid's G transitioning. Yeah. This guy right here who stole the governor's seat in New Jersey in 2021, I covered it. It was another one of them overnight. Oh, he caught up in one overnight type of deals. Okay. There were two elections going on that day. It was New Jersey and Virginia. And Virginia, there were not enough votes to steal. Okay. There were not enough votes to steal the seat from Glenn Youngkin. So he won. Uh, this guy, yeah, he, he they snuck one in in the middle of the night. So three school districts in the state of New Jersey require parental notification if a child begins transitioning their gender. As a result, they are being sued by the state. This is outrageous and shows that concerned parents who have been showing up at school board meetings in recent years have every right to be worried about where things are going. Imagine such a monumental thing happening to your child and the school you fund with your tax dollars hiding it from you. Oh, the state of New Jersey is suing the state of New Jersey. Att Attorney General Plotkin, Matthew Plotkin, filed civil rights complaints against Middletown Town. Chip, Marble Township, and Manalopan English Town Regional Districts this past week, mere hours after the district had approved the policies. It's the second time in 30 days that Platkin's office has gone to court over TG student rights. Platkin said in a statement that the you guys better get your kids out of these states if you live there. Platkin said in a statement that the state will not tolerate any action by schools that threaten the health and safety of kids. He called the districts uh policies discriminatory and said they were a severe risk to trans and non-binary kids five years ago the new jersey department of education issued regulations making gender-based decisions dependent upon students not parents new jersey and federal law require schools to ensure a safe and supportive environment for trans students if a student wants a tylenol for a headache however his or her parent must be notified even his, her, it, they, or them parent or must, must be notified. Yeah, it's a little confusing, guys. This is just plain wrong. State of New Jersey sues school district in attempt to eliminate parental right to no policies. The district's policy doesn't go as far as to prevent school employees from participating in gender transitions, though that would be ideal. Mark, Mark Levine tweets out, it's official. New Jersey Democrats hate parents and their kids. Boy, it's good thing Brad CGZ got out of there, man. It's all about power and control. The left wants state to supplant your family unit. Yes, they want to take your kids, dice them up, part out their, part them out, sell them for the for top dollar, right? Yeah, top dollar. Anyways, guys, the NPC show.com is live. Please check it out. Sign up for the newsletter on the right hand side. I'll send you an email when I, when I go live. And also, kick.com, give it a shot. Join me over there. We're going to do extended hangouts over there. Uh, we got about a third of the show is going to be there and there only. And also, we got videos to watch that we can't play on you, Tizzles. Yeah.